Hello guys and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to transmit and receive data over UART using serial application. Let's create a project in STM32Cube IDE. Create a new STM32 project. Check for the STM32 F103C8. Click next. And give your project a name. Let's call UART. And finish. Let's configure the project. Go to RCC. Select high speed clock as crystal ceramic resonator from system select serial wire and we are going to use UART so select this mode to asynchronous we are going to use interrupt so we should enable this option and from here you can set the parameters I'm going to left here as default let's go to the clock configuration we are going to use HSE Okay, now let's save this project in order to generate the code. Here is the programmer. RX pin of this module should connect to the TX pin of the SDM32. As you can see in the schematic is PA9. So this guy should connect to the A9. TX should be connect to the RX of SDM32. And it's just beside the A9. It's A10. And now I'm going to connect the ground to ground of SDM32. Connect the power supply. And the USB to TTL module. Now come to the UART section and enable the interrupt. Save this file and from the project go to core, source and open this file. We are gonna write the code whenever a data comes from the UART this function is gonna be triggered. And we are gonna collect all the data one by one here. And the data are going to be collected into an array and let's assign a counter. I should define the Rx data from this file as well. Save this and from here I should extend this variable. Okay, now let's debug. Go to debugger. Make sure that your debugger is connected to your PC. Select open OCD. And from generator options, select software system reset. Click apply and OK. Now in order to monitor the data coming from microcontroller PC and from PC to microcontroller, you can use my application. Just go to my GitHub page and from UART Serial Communication, download the application. If you see an error, just turn off your Wi-Fi and run it again. Select Run and there we go. First step is to select the baud rate. You just make the baud rate in uart.ioc as 115200. So I'm going to choose this baud rate and select the COM. In my case, it is COM5 and your COM port may be different as COM3, COM7 and etc. Select the COM port, click on open port as port open. 
Here you can see that the window is for sending the data to microcontroller over UART and data coming from the microcontroller are going to be monitored here. Select the live expressions. Here you can see that we have the variable. Okay, now let's run the program and send a data. Let's say microcontroller. Send it. And here you can see that the data has been received over UART. Microcontroller. You should check for the counter value in order to avoid any overflow. Okay, now let's transmit string from the SDM32 to PC. And now we should define the text here. Let's say, okay, save the file and run. And here we are going to receive the text. As you see, the data has been successfully transmitted from the STM32 to PC. Thanks for watching this video, guys. Please don't forget to like, share, and comment below. Also, subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos.